First, open the Fastman 92 limit adjuster. Then, open the files folder. Then again, open the files folder. Then, open the libraries folder. Then, open WinX86 folder. After that, select all the files of WinX86 folder and extract them into your GTA San Andreas game directory. You can have the GTA San Andreas game directory opened and just drag and drop all those files. After extracting all those files, the directory should look like this. Now there's just one more step before the limit adjuster is fully installed. Open the Fastman 92 limit adjuster archive file and navigate your way to a folder named additional files. Now, open the GTA SA folder, then open the data folder. There are seven files and a folder inside. You need to extract all those seven files into your GTA San Andreas game data folder. This is how your GTA San Andreas game data folder should look after extracting all those seven files. Inside your GTA San Andreas game data folder, there is a paths folder. Now go to the paths folder of limit adjuster. There is one file inside it. You need to extract that file inside your GTA San Andreas game data paths folder. This completes the installation of Fastman 92 Limit Adjuster in your GTA San Andreas game. But, the Limit Adjuster will not work if you don't have an ASI loader installed in your GTA San Andreas game. Also, there are more rules to follow while using the Fastman 92 Limit Adjuster, like having supported version of the game. I hope you found this video helpful, and if you did, please like this video and subscribe our channel. Comment if you have any queries or video requests.